From the uh, Chibuku deposit, Zambezi Valley, Zimbabwe. Now this is mainly smoky quartz. A, well, what is it? Elestial scepter. Many things. Um, a, an exercise in crystallography. That's all I could say. Very, very difficult to photograph these. They are high luster. I'll give you an indication. There we go. This is a tiny bit underexposed, but this will give you an indication of the actual crystal forms. Lots of patterning of the smoky quartz inside here. Turn it around this way. So, from whichever angle we look at it, it's a, it's a different viewpoint. High luster. You can see right through these guys. And even the darker ones, we have some immensely dark uh, amethysts here as well, and smokies. So, they have the fire of the Brandberg quartz. They just need very, very good lighting, um, backlighting. Often we find in hydros inside these. I'm going to move it there. There seems to be a little vugs inside there. Let's see if we see any motion, which would be tiny, tiny water bubbles, water come gas bottles trapped inside them. So this is, well, could we call this an elestial scepter? There's a whole family sitting on the stem. It's not a floater. You can see there it was attached to mother ore, so it may have sat like this in nature. Now let's give it one more turn, give you an indication. So with these uh, Zambezi Valley quartzes, you really do need to look at the videos uh, to get a better indication, because the still pictures uh, really does them uh, no justice. They are full of fire, full of life, lovely. And this is quite a large specimen as well. And that's all from the Zambezi Valley, uh, Zambezi Valley Quartz, Zimbabwe.